there is a very good relation between Nigeria and Al Azhar Al Sharif. And there is a lot of students. <laughs> we want to, to talk about that. Well, let me start by thanking the Azhar Kingdom for the long standing relationship with Nigeria. This relationship has been there for a very long time. We have hundreds of Nigerian students studying across various fields in uh, Azhar University. And even recently, some weeks back, we had another batch of Nigerians coming uh, to study in Azhar. We can only thank the Azhar King Shekdom for, for the cooperation and the support given to Nigerian students. I've had the uh, privilege of meeting Sheikh Azhar himself, and he assured me of his continuous support and cooperation. The relationship has been long-standing, and it has been very, very rewarding for Nigeria. And we can only thank the Shekdom for it. I think you are one of the students, right? <laughs> <laughs> I, I am one of the students of a study in Egypt initiative. Tell us your, your lovely memory here. I, I came here and it is only important for me to be able to speak the language mm -hmm. of the community that I am now living in. So based on the initiative, the wonderful initiative of President Abdul Fattah al-Sisi, of Africa should speak Arabic. I also enrolled myself into uh, Cairo University and started learning Arabic from the scratch. I think it's a wonderful initiative. We should be able to speak more African languages. And I really, really commend uh, President Abdul Fattah al-Sisi for this initiative. Yeah, thank you. Um, there is many, many uh, Nigerian community here and they love the country. Uh, how, how, the, how many the population is uh, here in Cairo? Of course, we love the community. We love the country. We love Cairo. Everybody living in this country, I can assure you the Nigerian community are living harmoniously uh, in Egypt. Our relation is very cordial and we have a significant number of Nigerians that are doing very well in this country in uh, many international uh, uh, organizations we have in Afrex Bank and other places. We also have young Nigerian entrepreneurs doing very well in Egypt, law-abiding citizens, and of course, we love it here. Oh, thank you. Um, finally, we want to to know your opinion about Egypt. How do you see Egypt from you, 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 you be student and until now? Well, a, a lot of a changing, right? <laughs> I have been in foreign service for 30 years. Mm -hmm. I've had the privilege of uh, serving in London, the United Kingdom, in New York, the United States of America, in Abu Dhabi, the United Arab Emirates, the three United countries. But believe me, uh, I think this is by far the best of all my postings. Oh, Egypt! <laughs> Thank you. Egypt is one place that uh, uh, I would recommend to anybody and everybody. The people are very hospitable. The relations with Nigeria is very good, and we are determined, together with my counterpart, Ambassador Ihab Mustafa Awad, to deepen those relations because. There's uh, mutual respect, mutual likeness between President Muhammad Buhari of Nigeria and President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi. These are two great committed African leaders through whom I think Africa's future is bright. Uh, there is a similar uh, culture between Nigeria and Egypt? Absolutely. Like what? <laughs> we have religious affinities. Mm -hmm. We also have... Uh, common uh, love for sports and leisure, soccer. We have uh, lots of Nigerians uh, uh, involved in sports activities in this country. We also have our musical troops and cultural troops coming from time to time to perform in Egypt. Uh, we have love for Egyptian musicians and arts. And uh, of course, one thing, one area that I've not touched is uh, medical tourism. Ah, okay. 
Egypt is the number one destination for Nigerians in terms of medical tourism. Okay. We have hundreds coming to Egypt at every point in time for their medical needs. Uh -huh. okay. And I hope, I hope the relationship will continue to prosper because most of Nigerians coming here do get treated in good, reputable Egyptian hospitals. Thank you. Finally, I like your style. This is the Nigerian uh, galabaya or what? And mm -hmm. this, the, the, the hat. Uh, and the hat. <laughs> yeah. This is a, a typical uh, Nigerian dressing mm -hmm. where we have the kaftan. We call it the kaftan to be complemented with the cap. Mm -hmm. And uh, every part of the country do wear this and the cap. So this is a typical... All the tribes? All the tribes. They wear a cap, mm -hmm. but different style of cap. In the southeast is different, in the southwest is different, and in the north is different. This is the typical northern style. This is the northern? This is the northern style. Okay. <laughs> thank you very much. <laughs> really, I'm enjoyed uh, to interview you, Ambassador. And thank you so much to be with us in Zoom Africa. Thank you very much for having us, and uh, I wish you the very best. Thank you. Enjoy the good weather. <laughs> thank you so much.